Hey guys, good morning. Welcome back to Mushka Delights. It's Saturday morning. We're going to be making some breakfast and I am going to be making some pancakes. Some <coughs> pancakes. I'm going to put bananas and chocolate chips. So it's going to be banana and chocolate chip pancakes. And here we go. So all you're going to need is one banana you want to make sure that it's soft like this too because it comes out better and one banana you're going to need a teaspoon of vanilla so we're going to take the banana mm -hmm. and we are going to let me get this comfortable here so you can see what I'm doing because I feel like you cannot see. I'm gonna take one banana, I'm gonna smash it up. It's already sauce, so it should be ready. You can smash it up. I'm gonna take one egg. We're gonna do a half a teaspoon, a teaspoon of vanilla. So we're gonna put this is a half a teaspoon. We're gonna go with two of these vanilla, vanilla, vanilla. Then we're gonna mix again. Take ground cinnamon, and I get those couple sprinkles, couple couple sprinkles. Let's see if you can see from here now. Now we're going to take ground cinnamon, and I get those couple sprinkles couple couple sprinkles Let's see if you can see from here now no, you see it but you can't really see it like I need something to level out okay there you go I really need to sit this out. Oh, hold on. Alright guys, we're back. So put a little bit of cinnamon in it. Mix that up. And now we're going to take Take a cup of light and fluffy pancake mix. So I just eyeball it. We're gonna put two cups. What I like to do is I like to put milk in it. I do not use water. I like milk in my um pancakes. So I love it nice and fluffy. I want to say like a quarter of milk. You know, pour some in. 
you mix it up some and you're going to see how it looks and then you're going to pour more in. So this is kind of thick. So you see it's thick. So we're going to add a little bit more. Now I can go from this to the whisk. Whisk it up. From the fork to the whisk. That's how I like it. Nope. <coughs> Excuse me. So right now, what we can do is we can take. I want to say like a. I don't want to throw a lot of chocolate chips and stuff. I want to throw a quarter. Half a cup. Half a cup is enough. I'm going to put it in there. And I got the milk chocolate. I just fold it in now. Now you don't wanna You don't wanna mix it in a lot because you don't want them to crunch up or smash up or anything. You wanna get those chunks of chocolate in there. So now what I do is I put it in the refrigerator and I let it sit in the refrigerator for like about five minutes so that way I just like when it like poofs up and it's like better it's like more fluffier you'll see what I'm talking about so. all right guys we are back and we are going to make the bacon uh, you know different kind of bacon but I liked the Jimmy Dean bacon thick slices we're going to put it in the oven I like to cook it in the oven I'm gonna hit big. I'm gonna put 400. Start so that way you can start 400 in the oven. Uh, I like to put parchment paper down. Let's take a piece of parchment paper. But this parchment paper never wants to like stay. Open. And I'm just gonna take the pieces and then oh, there you go, the parchment. You see what the freaking thing does all the time? Come on. Hey. Lay them out, and you want to give them each some space. And while your pancakes are in the refrigerator, setting up, you could go ahead and start your bacon or your sausage or whatever you like to eat. You could go ahead and start that process. Extra piece right here. Is it? Hey, making breakfast. Don't touch. Don't touch. Mommy, don't touch. Making breakfast. Don't touch. I know you like to be on the camera. Don't touch. Oh my god, my son is messing with it. Stop. Sorry, guys. Don't touch. Move. Move away. Don't touch. Don't touch. No. Get out of the kitchen. 
Get out of the kitchen. Sorry guys, this is what happens when you have kids. So, back to it. Alright. So that beacon is all lined up, see? I'm gonna pop it in the pop it in the oven for like about 15 minutes. So we're gonna pop that thing in there. Hey guys, I'm back. Okay, so right now I'm going to be making some eggs. Come back. Okay. I'm gonna get some scrambled eggs for my husband to go with his bacon. to put a little bit of milk. Just a little bit. Wow. Cheese. Alright. Parsley. Take a pinch. Ooh. Pepper. Here it comes. No, don't touch. Whoa, touching. Don't touch. No, don't touch. Alex. Need some salt. Alex. He's hungry. He's like, I want my breakfast. Alright, so that's that. I'm gonna get a fork here, mix it all up. Alex. Butter, put it in the pan. Put that not up some while that melts up. I'm gonna cut this cucumber because I'm gonna put it on the plate next to his food. It's nice and fresh in the morning. Plate. I'm gonna put it right there on his plate. His bacon's gonna be here, his eggs is gonna be here. I'm gonna mix that butter around some. Yeah. 
on the bacon oh that bacon is coming out nice all right back to the eggs gonna get the whole thing but this side kinda stuck. Okay. Pat it down some, make it form it up again. And try again. Pat it down some, make it form it up again. And try again. Alright, next to it. Hey guys, we back. My husband was so hungry, he took his food. He ate it already, but I took a picture for you guys. Mm. All right, guys, we are back. My husband was so hungry, he took his food, but I took a picture for you guys so you can see it. <laughs> All righty. Uh, we are here now. And we're gonna be making a pancake. Bacon is done though. Bacon is done. Bacon is done. Bacon is done. Move these things down just a little bit. And we're gonna start making. All right, so this is what I was talking about. You see how much it poofed, poofed up, and I poofed up. Poof. Upstairs in the closet. So I like to wait until there's like bubbles coming out of the top so that way you can know that the bottom is done. You wait for bubbles. When the bacon come out, you're going to want to take it off of the parchment paper. Turn these down to low medium. You want to take it off the parchment paper, put it on some paper towel because it's going to be oily from all that grease. You get all that grease out of there. So I just take and put it on paper towel, take another paper towel to dry all the oil off. Alright, so it looks like it's ready to be. Up to the bottom. 
But there it is. Whoa. Okay. Let's Bam. Bam. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. At least that to the bottom. But there it is. Whoa. Okay. Let's Bam. Bam. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Nice fluffy big pancakes. Oh yeah. I ain't even going to the front on you guys. Sometimes pancakes do get burnt. I'll scrub it off, give it to the kids. They don't care, they're going to eat it. I ain't going to front on y'all. Burnt the pancake. It's, it's reality. It's not a TV show where I really burn stuff. This really does happen. I'll scrub it off, give it to the kids. They don't care, they're going to eat it. I ain't going front on y'all. Burnt the pancake. It's, it's reality. It's not a TV show where I really burn stuff. This really does happen. So find somebody spray something. Right. For a little bit more second guys welcome back so these are my other pancakes that I made what I noticed is they got a little darker too so what I think it is it is the don't freak out if your pancakes come out dark like this I remember that we have banana in it so that's the caramelization from the banana that's why it's like that mmm these pancakes gonna be delicious 